Domestic violence disorder, what I've been calling DVD, isn't just one of my ideas, it's a reality. Um, I've lived through it, I do live through it day to day, and it is a brain disease where the sufferer is unaware or unwilling to admit that they have the brain disease. Um, it's a situation in which a person becomes a positive tyrant within their house relationships, their living relationships, with their closest partner or friend or loved one, um, being the victim of their abuse and anger and their explosions of vitriol. Um, D DVD can be subdued. It can, um, it can, uh, seem to remit until an incident occurs. And that incident can be totally minute. It can be something that doesn't matter at all, that, uh, that any normal person would be able to get over. But the sufferer of DVD cannot get over this thing. That whatever the incident is, that is the most important thing in the world to the sufferer of DVD at the time. And they use that incident as justification for all of their anger and all of their feelings to be let out upon the, the person responsible for the incident. It's, the incident has certain qualities and it's, um, it, it has to be something that they can blame a partner for or the, the victim of DVD for. Um, an incident can't just be like, like, uh, somebody closing the door, um, but if they close the door too loud, or if they close the door and that reveals that a light was left on, or something like that, then whatever can be blamed upon the person could qualify as an incident in, in DVD. And once the person has been blamed for whatever was wrong, then that thing keeps kept get, getting brought up over and over again as, as the conversation, the argument, is fueled by total irrationality. Um, a person with DVD does not care about equanimity or um, being, being magnanimous or, or trying to see the, the situation from the other person's perspective or from a third party's perspective. Instead, they have no sense of humor. They have no ability to, to rein in their anger. And as a result, it's just, it's one of the most horrendous things that I've ever lived through. It's just, it's insufferably uncomfortable. It's annoying. It's terrible. I hate it. And yet, it's something that I'm stuck with probably for my whole life in, in my relationships. Um, because it is something that is truly part of a person's character. DVD is not easy to shed. It is something that you have to realize that you have and that you have to get rid of through vigilance and through um, training and through practice. You have to be aware, be truly self-aware so that when you're starting to overreach your authority and you're starting to become a tyrant, you're starting to become a, a torturer in the household, that you stop because you know you have that problem. It takes an incredible amount of maturity to admit that you have that problem. And most people don't ever do that, that have DVD. Um, and there is no cure for it. There's no medication, there's no therapy that's known to solve domestic violence disorder. It's a terrible disorder. I, I hate it. It's really, really loathsome. Anyway, thank you for watching. Take care. Goodbye.